last words? I'll see you in hell. <laughs> String him up. Cut that one pretty damn close. You're still alive, ain't you? He wouldn't be if we waited till you finished with that Mexican girl. Too bad, too. She had all the right. Let's go. Intoxication. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> or, for the more uncultivated among you, rip roaring drunk. Yeah. <laughs> Whereupon, once under the influence of said spirit, the hapless inebriate, his memory and all pretense of propriety, having gone down the drain with the liquor, rapidly descends to a state of idiotic oblivion. <laughs> Having accomplished nothing more than to drown his sorrows for the moment. His pride and his vanity, if any, tossed onto the dung heap of public notoriety. But far be it from me to condemn the devotee of Bacchus for basking in the warm glow of a glass of whiskey. Dolce, Faniente, sweet idleness. Come, come, my good man. Yes, Mr. Green. <laughs> I'll double it. 
Attaboy, Jack. Jack? Say, you wouldn't be Texas Jack, would you? The one who killed that gambler fell over in Douglas? What's it to you? Nothing. Just curious. He was running an eight-handed poker game. So I put him between his eyes. I'll see ya. No raise. I'm out. I got a 45 pointed just below your belly. Put your hands on the table. So you're in this together, huh? You got the job on me now, but I'll catch up with you. All right, everybody. Shooting, unless one of y'all starts it. Cash me in. Nah, -uh. gold. Coming right up. Your health, sir. Colonel. When he comes to, you tell him my name's Frame Johnson. Matt Cole. Luther McKinney. Told you we should have robbed that bank. Now what are we gonna do? There's a bank in Dragoon. Well, that's north. I thought we were heading south. I've been thinking about that. Maybe it's time we change directions. Maybe our luck will change too. What do you say, Luther? North it is. With any luck, we can make Dragoon by tomorrow and make a sizable withdrawal. Where are we headed, Dutch? As far away from the border as we can get. I don't favor getting my neck stretched again. We were talking. We figured it's about time we got a bigger share. Just how do you figure that? You're Dutch's woman, y'all can split a share. I may be his woman, but I risk my life same as you. Maybe more. She's right. It was her that killed the sheriff in Nogales. While you three were hightailing it out of town. He would have shot Dutch in the back if it hadn't been for me. Reckon you got your answer. 
take what you get or get out. You heard him. Well, that's mighty bold talk for a woman. Don't let my curves fool you, Sonny. Ease up, boys. All right, Dutch. Play it your way. For now. Wouldn't turn my back on him if I were you. I won't. Why don't we go it alone, Dutch? Just you and me. You really like this outfit stuff, don't you? Yeah, especially this part. $30,000. $30,000! That's all the money we got! We're gonna be put out of business. We've gotta get that money back! Mr. Fisk, don't you think you should put on some pants first? How did you know where I was? Good morning, Mr. Fisk. Good morning, ma'am. Excuse me. What's that? Breakfast. Compliments of your wife. Oh, between you and me? I wouldn't drink the coffee if I were you. Good day, ma'am. Excuse me.
Well, there she is, boys of Colorado. Wine, women, and song. Here we come. Uh, it's still a half day's ride. Our horses need rest. The light here. I reckon this is as good as place as any if we have to put up a fight. So I'm standing behind the counter, and these two guys walk in, and this son of a bitch says, put your hands up, boy. So I put my hands up. And then what happened? I want you to get that money back, Tyler. I'll do what I can. Remember who it is that got you elected. Folks, Edward Fisk is a man of his word. And you have my word, you're gonna get your money back! How long do you figure of staying in Colorado, Frame? I don't know, a month? Maybe two? At least while all that money runs out. Well, then what? We'll just have to see what cards were dealt, I guess. Oh, with $30,000, we had to have a pretty good time. <laughs> we don't get too crazy, eh, Luther? Well, it doesn't seem to matter one way or the other, does it? No. I guess it don't. Say, how'd you come by that deck with a bullet hole in it? By chance, really. You see, the bullet was meant for my heart. Lucky for me, it was this Derringer. The tin horn who owned it wasn't so lucky. Take first watch. Ugh. I can't eat no more beans. Good morning, Mr. Nolan. Hmm? Good morning. Good morning, Mrs. Nolan. I, you know, I just, uh, I just don't feel I deserve a beautiful young wife like you. Well, you're stuck with me, Mr. Nolan. I'm going to make you a wonderful wife and bear you lots of children. I'm going to go for a swim. I'll join you. As soon as I'm, as soon as I'm done here. Didn't mean to scare you. 
How long have you been here? Long enough. Do you make it a habit to spy on women when they bathe? Are you here alone? Of course not. My husband's over there. Husband? Yes. Now, if you don't mind. Now, I want to meet your husband. I want to see what kind of man has a wife pretty as you. We were riding by when we saw your wife swimming at the uh, Rio. It ain't often you get to see something like that. Well, now that you've seen it, why don't you just get on your way? So, uh, what are you doing out here? Just travel. We're on our way to Warm Springs. We were married yesterday. Congratulations. Newlyweds. Viva los novios! You got a pretty wife. What's your name? Olivia. Olivia Nolan. Hmm, Olivia. Pretty name. I thought we were here for money, Dutch. Dutch? Would that be Dutch Henry? You heard of me? Oh, yeah. I've heard of you. Then you know I'll kill you if I have to. Now what about that money? It's in the wagon. It's just a few dollars. Why don't you just take it and, and get? I'll get it. Never mind. Brady! Juan! There's only $45 in here! Not much to start a married life on, our pretty one. Choice, lady, not mine. Come in with us. You'll die. You'll die. 
He's gonna die anyway. You're coming with us. There ain't no reason to take her. Karina's right. She'll only slow us down. I said we're gonna take her with us. What? Settle up the wagon horse. See, Patron. No. no. Killing you is what I'm going to do last. Wagon and no horses. Out in the middle of nowhere? Don't seem right, does it? Let's grab a look. They took my wife. Who? Who took your wife? Touch Henry. You gotta get her back. Promise me you'll get her back for me. Let's we'll see if there's a shovel in the wagon. Well. Tracks lead up toward them hills. It's, it's a wedding photograph. Oh, they must have just got married. Pretty woman. Poor devil. Frame. Posse. Sure as hell acting like one. Get far where they're going. Let's take a look at that wagon. There she is. We'd be across her in 15 minutes. 10 if we're lucky. Yeah. She's a beautiful woman. You know
know what they'll do to her. Kill her first would be better off. All right. What's it going to be? Let's get to it. I still light it on the trail. Yeah. Get it. Shot him in the back. Look at this. The woman must be his wife. Where is she? Art, look in the wagon. No horses. Give me my Bible. I'll read over him. Camp here. I say we head back to Guadalupe Pass. It's quicker. Sam's right. This is crazy. We can't go through the pass. Every lawman at the border be waiting for us. I'd rather take my chances with the law than going through there. I'm with Sam. I'm for heading back. We're going through Maricopa Wilds. I run this outfit. And we're going the way we're headed. Any objections? What about her? She goes with me. How far? As far as I want her to go. Brady! One! Up on the rocks! Bomb well, Nixon. You'll forget all about him. I pray to God I'm there to see you hanged. Maybe you will. But by then, it wouldn't matter. nothing into this world, and it's certain we can take nothing out. The Lord gave, and the Lord has taken away. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. Ike, you and Ark take the first watch. I'll spell you in a few hours. We leave at sunup. Bill. Bill, you and I have been friends for a long time, so I, I figure we can talk plain. What's on your mind, Ben? How many lives are you willing to risk to get that $30,000 back? What are you getting at? Just this. We go chasing into that kind of country after them bank robbers, we might not never come out. That's a chance we have to take. Why? To satisfy Ed Fisk? What's Ed Fisk got to do with it? Everybody in town knows it was Ed Fisk's money that got you elected, and it's his money we're after. You think I'm doing this for Ed Fisk? You want to be reelected, you. Look, Ben, 
There's a hell of a lot more at stake here than my re-election. There's a dead man out there, and maybe a dead woman. So? They ain't the reason we came out here in the first place. Now, nobody has to know about them but us. Look, Ben, I'm gonna forget you said that. If you want to pull out, go on. You come first light, I'm going on. They rode up here all right. No use trying to find them in the dark. Seen anything? It's a coyote. And them outlaws are probably miles from here by now. Yeah. Out there in the bad lands. Say, uh, how much water you got in your canteen? Yeah, a little more than half. Why? There's no water out there. Ah, you know that. Tyler's got us riding straight into hell, and all you got is a half a canteen of water, same as me. Oh, it'll last more than two days. Maybe figures we'll catch up to him before then. <laughs> Not likely. The way I see it, we're riding with blinders on. We don't know what's waiting for us out there. I never figured out nothing like this. I guess none of us did. What about Tyler? <laughs> That's easy. He's looking at another four years as sheriff. All he has to do is get Ed Fisk's $30,000 back, and he's a shoe in Why can't we talk to him? I Maybe already he... tried that. He won't listen to reason. Now look, there's only one thing to do, and that's to pull out. You crazy? That's desertion. You want to die out there? You think about it, Art. Only take my advice. Don't take long. Get some sleep, Art. I'll wake you around five. Anything wrong? Nah, nothing's wrong. I just suddenly got thirsty. How much longer are we gonna wait? Take it easy, kid. He's bound to make a mistake sooner or later. When he does, no mass. Well, there's three of us. I say we jump them right now. Kid, your trigger finger itches that bad. You go ahead and scratch it. But for me, I'm gonna wait until the odds is a bit more in my favor. I think like Sam. Maybe it's better to wait like he says. See? So, you're Dutch's girl now. I suppose I knew it happened sooner or later. If you think I want any part of him, you're crazy. All I want is to see him hanged. There have been times I wanted to see him hanged too.
I suppose I shouldn't hate you. But I can't help it. If I get the chance, I'm gonna kill you. Let her go. What if I don't want to? This is between me and Dutch. I should have put this through your heart. What's wrong with you? You've never been this jealous before. She's too pretty for her own good. You're on the other side of the rifle. How many times have I told you? Never take your eyes off a man when you have the drop on him! You better watch her. I don't think she likes you. I'll kill her if I get the chance. She means it. We never should have brought her with us. I say we either kill her or cut her loose. You know what? Maybe you are more trouble than what you're worth. We ain't killing her, and we ain't cutting her loose. What's what's that saying? Um, it spoils the war. There's another saying. The queen is dead. Long live the queen. Long live the queen. All right, Dutch. If that's the way you want it. Well, it ain't all right with me. Cards is stacked against us as it is. And we don't need no joker in this deck. Maybe it's time for you to show your hand, Sam. Stand pat, Sam. All the cards ain't dealt yet. Could be Dutch is holding the aces and eights. All right, Dutch. You can keep dealing. For now. Sure is dark. Funny how the dark does things to a man's mind, kind of twists things all out of reason. Frame's been gone better part of an hour. <laughs> Maybe he changed his mind and hightailed it across the river. I wouldn't blame him if he did. We gotta be crazy going after a woman we ain't never met. She across that river and headed up north when we had the chance.
You get cold feet, Luther? Who, me? They're up there, all right. I heard a gunshot. A gunshot? Yeah. It sounded close. Maybe a half mile. I couldn't tell exactly where it came from. What do you make of it? Don't know. Could have been shooting a snake. Or a woman. Maybe. What's he new, Luther? Suppose they did kill her. We'd be chasing after him for nothing. Look! We're not the law frame. We're just doing a man a favor. A dead man. For all we know, his wife's dead too. Sounds like you want to turn back. I'm just figuring the odds. And right now, they're not stacking up in our favor. Well, you're right about that. I've been thinking. Thinking hard. <laughs> we got $30,000 in our saddlebags. That's more money than any of us have ever seen. Colorado's just across the river. We can get around that posse easy. Sure we could, Luther, but what if the woman isn't dead? Still none of our business. We're not the law, Frame. I suppose you're right. What about you, Matt? Well, we got this far. Might as well see it through to the end. I reckon that's how I see it, too. It's your deal. Let's get mounted. Why are we stopping? Instinct. Ready. One. We'll wait here. I get the feeling we're getting followed. Okay, Dutch. We'll catch up with you. Come on. Hey, 
to your husband didn't die after all. He's coming to your rescue. You're done for. There's nothing we can do for you. Where's the girl? We Dutch Henry. Where are they? Up. Up the head. Hmm. 
Let's get to it. Wait! Don't leave me to the coyotes! Finish me! Have they had more power press? Me. Boy. La. Tier. Mi madre. Who the hell are they? I don't know, but they got this far. Friends of yours? I only wish they were. Well, maybe you got friends you didn't even know you had. Friend! Up on the ridge! Let's get after him! Whoa! Hold up. If we go after him, we're likely to run into another ambush. Let's work our way around that ridge, and we'll catch up with them on the far side. Let's go. Yeah! Get them! This is something. This is really something. Looks like four, maybe five horses rolled this way with the other three. First time we've seen them tracks. Looks like there's more than we figured. Well, I guess that's that then. We can turn around and go back. Nobody's turning back. You crazy? There ain't enough of us to go after that many men. It'd be suicide. Not if we catch them by surprise. And what if we don't? That's a chance we have to take. You mean you'll have to take? You're the only one with a stake in this, Bill. Not any of us. I'm gonna forget you said that, Ben. Let's get going. Nah, you can go. I'm turning back. Anybody else thinking of turning back? It's Juan Montoya. He's full of buckshot. Another one over there. Looks like Brady Bell. They're part of Dutch Henry's gang. What do you make of it? Could have been a fight over money. Or a woman. 
I don't like it. We joined up to chase down a few bank robbers, not Dutch Henry. That's a job for the state militia. You're right, Art, it is. By the time they get down here, that trail will be colder than them two bodies. You got no right to ask us to do this, Bill. We ain't professional lawmen. Art's right. This ain't our affair no more. Now it's time we turn back. I give you my solemn word. I'll kill the first man that tries. Mount up! Rest here for a while. Get up in them rocks and keep watch. Better take a drink while we still have water. What are you gonna do with me? Anything I want. And you better not ever turn your back on me or fall asleep. Because I will find a way to kill you, so help me God. You know, I think you would. idea. The idea is you ain't running things no more. So what? You're thrown in with him? Well, the way I see it, there ain't much future with you anymore. Get up! Wait, you gonna shoot me? I ain't gonna shoot you, it'd be too easy. I'm gonna give you what you want. You can have her all to yourself. Sam! Get their horses. Hey, you can't leave me out here without a horse! You can ride her. I'll kill you for this. You hear me? You hear me? I'll find you! I'll kill you! Come looking for me, I'll be in no gallus. No gallus? The next time you two meet, it'll be in hell. Adios, Dutch. Enjoy the sun and your new love. Ha! Uh oh. You're not gonna die on me. You and I, we get some unfinished business in Mesquite.
These horses need rest. Suppose when we do find that woman frame, what are we going to do with her? See if she's got any family, I guess. See if she gets to him. Funny how things work out. One day you're married and the next you're a widow. I don't think I'll ever get married. No, sir. I've been with Lady Luck for so long, I wouldn't even know how to treat another woman. <laughs> this wife's not a decent one. <laughs> Ain't none of us got a right being with any decent woman. Not the way we've been living our lives. Right, Frame? Yeah, I guess so. You ever been married, Frame? Long time ago. She died in childbirth. She and the boy she was carrying. Hell, I haven't been any good since then. Just drifting. Yeah. Drifting. I've been doing a lot of hard thinking ever since we found that dying man. Our problem is we've been living by our gun so long we don't know what's decent anymore. Well, maybe there was a reason why we found him. Maybe for once in our lives we can do something decent. Something honorable. Like getting that woman back like he asked us to do. Idea. You ain't Duchess woman no more. I ain't nobody's woman no more. Let's go. Sam! Even a woman like me's got priorities, and you ain't one of them. You think you're too good for me? No, Sam. I just don't want you. I just dumped one son of a bitch, and I'm not looking for another. Horses.
Where's the woman? Luther. Matt! Matt! It's the end of the line for me, Frame. I'm sorry, Matt. I guess we should have crossed that river, huh? I'll be crossing the river soon enough. It's, it's getting dark. It's a long frame. Get up! I'm here! Get me! You gotta get up! Come on, you'll die! Come on! Get up! Come on! We'll finish this at the other side of the river. This time, you ain't gonna be in no more trouble. I'm tired of this.
with me or not? Sure, I'm with you, Ben. It's just that we're committing suicide going after Dutch Henry, and you know it. This ain't our affair, Hart. Dutch Henry never did nothing to us. Tyler's only in this so he can get reelected. We go to jail for deserting. Only if he comes back. You ain't planning on killing him. We won't have to. Dutch Henry will do that for us. He's been hitting that bottle pretty hard. As soon as he falls asleep, we'll light out of here and he'll never hear us. So what about it? Are you with me or ain't you? What about Dorgan? I'll take care of him. I have no feeling in my hands. Can you untie them? Now, you bastard! I have the night! What are you gonna do? Kill you! All right, kill me. I hate killing me! I'm going back. If you follow me, I swear to God, I'll cut your heart out! Yeah, all right. You know, things change out here in the dark. You know, it's easy to get lost out here in the desert at night. Are you sure you know your way back? Huh? I remember the way. You know, you gotta watch out for rattlesnakes. Shut, shut up! You know, I once knew a man that uh, got bit by a gilly monster. That gilly monster just hung in there. He kept on biting him until he died. Ike! Ike! My head! What hit me? Ben and Art are gone. One of them must have hit you. Gone? They pulled out during the night. It's my fault. I should have stayed awake. What do we do now? You've lost a lot of blood. You better rest up here. I'm going on. Oh, I can make it. Maybe I ain't. I'll be back as soon as I can.
We're being followed, and I don't even know who it is. You make a sound. Want the woman? I gave you the woman for a horse and a rifle. What do you say, huh? that bed. Don't move. Give me your gun. I've been tracking you quite a ways. Who are you? The name's Johnson. Frame Johnson. Who's that down there? It's Dutch Henry. Dutch Henry? You two have a fallen out? I don't get you. Don't you? You left a trail of bodies a blind man could follow, starting with that fellow with the wagon, and ending right here with you and Dutch Henry shooting it out to see who's going to control the gang. You got it all wrong, Sheriff. 
Dutch Henry's gang killed the man with the wagon and took his wife. He was still alive when we found him. He died just as he rode up. Then you're the ones that robbed the bank. Yeah. Yeah, I guess we did. Why are you following Dutch Henry? To get that man's wife back. I don't get you, Johnson. You could have made it across to Colorado. Instead, you follow a man's wife you don't even know. What made you change your mind? I don't know. Where's the woman now? She's down there with Dutch Henry. I had him cornered till you came in. I don't have a pair of cuffs to put on you. Will you give me your word you won't try to get away? Under one condition. Let me finish what I set out to do. Get that man's wife back. Then I'll come back with you. Why is that so important to you? It's a long story, Sheriff. Good luck. trial's over. I'd like to shake your hand. You may be a bank robber. Ex-bank robber. Right, Mr. Johnson? That's right, ma'am. What I wanted to say was, that was quite a thing you done saving that man's wife, and, well, you may be a bank robber. Ex-bank robber. Oh, heck, Mr. Johnson. I just wanted you to know why I voted to give you just one year in jail. We all voted for a year. I mean, our husbands did. A year in jail would do you real good, Mr. Johnson. Yes, ma'am, I'm sure you're right. Thank you. Thank you all. Well, Frame, what you gonna do once you get out? Well, I used to be a good cow hand. Maybe I'll try my hand at punting cattle again. 
At least it's honest work. Well, let's get going. Just a minute. Someone here wants to say goodbye to you. I <laughs> got pretty easy for that. The year ain't so bad. No, I guess it ain't. You know, I never got a chance to thank you for saving my life. You didn't have to do it, but you did. I'd like to ask why. I lost my wife, too. I couldn't just ride away. What will you do when you get out? She won't be robbing no more banks. How about you? Try to get my life back together, I guess. Yeah. Would you mind if I wrote you while you were gone? No, ma'am. I'd like that a lot. Bye, ma'am. Bye. May I call you Olivia, ma'am? I'd like that very much. May I call you Frame? Yes, ma'am. Sure can. Get up. Get up. I'll send a letter right away. I'll be looking for it. Will you write me back? You count on it. I sure do like that name. Frame Johnson. Frame 